Tomorrow, in a very real sense, your life, the life you author from scratch on your own, begins. How will you use your gifts? What choices will you make? Will inertia be your guide, or will you follow your passions? Will you follow dogma, or will you be original? Will you choose a life of ease, or a life of service and adventure? Will you wilt under criticism, or will you follow your convictions? Will you bluff it out when you're wrong, or will you apologize? Will you guard your heart against rejection, or will you act when you fall in love? Will you play it safe, or will you be a little bit swashbuckling? When it's tough, will you give up, or will you be relentless? Will you be a cynic, or will you be a builder? Will you be clever at the expense of others, or will you be kind? I will hazard a prediction. When you are 80 years old, and in a quiet moment of reflection, narrating for only yourself the most personal version of your life story, the telling that will be most compact and meaningful will be the series of choices you have made. In the end, we are our choices. Build yourself a great story. We all have adversity in our lives. You, you, I, I, I would, I would, I doubt if you really, you know, if you know somebody, any friend or anybody that you talk to, um, uh, there's no lack of adversity. And the, uh, and by the way, that's good because it's what teaches us how to get back up. You fall down, you get back up. It always happens. And uh, you know, you get certain um, gifts in life, and you want to take advantage of those. Um, uh, but you, I guess my advice on adversity and uh, success would be to be proud not of your gifts, but of your hard work and your choices. So, you know, you may be, the kinds of gifts you get in life, you know, you might be really good at math. It might be really easy for you. That's a kind of gift. Um, but practicing that math and taking it to the next step that could be very challenging and hard um, and take a lot of sweat. That's a choice. You can't really be proud of your gifts because they were given to you. Um, you can be grateful for them and thankful for them. Um, and, but your choices, you choose to work hard. Um, you choose to do hard things. Those are choices that you can be proud of. Being an inventor requires...